Hello and welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to use the split screen and slide over apps functions on your iPad, which are great for multitasking. So let's begin. First off, let's enable the split screen on your iPad. We do this by going to settings. Then on the left hand side, go down to the home screen and dock. Over on the right, multitasking. And we just want to enable allow multiple apps. Let's go back to the home screen. Now, to use split screen, it's best to launch the apps from the dock. So I'm going to drag and drop the notes app onto the dock. By pressing and holding, you can just ignore the menu and just drag that onto the dock. Okay, great. So what we'll want to do is a split screen. Let's start with Safari and we'll use the aforementioned notes. Now, if I just swipe up from the bottom and I need to do this gently, otherwise it's just going to close the app. I need to swipe up gently and I have the dock and I'll grab notes, ignore the menu and just drag it across to the right hand side. And as you can see, we are now in split screen mode. I can move this split to the right and I can move it to the left. Uh, Apple has predetermined uh, divisions here and I can pop it back into the center. What I can also do is swap these windows around and you do that by dragging the, or grabbing the bar at the top here and just pulling across, like so. If I want to close one of these windows, I'll just grab the bar and drag it to the far right or far left and the app will close. Great, so let's grab Safari again, put another split screen up and what you'll or well, what you may want to do is swap one half of these screens with another app. So again, we just swipe up from the bottom and let's say, for example, you want to have Chrome as a split screen instead. You just drag it across and that will take its place. To use slide over apps, gently swipe up from the bottom of the screen, grab an app you'd like to use. I'll use the Safari here and just drop it over the division line. What you'll notice is the app will float and if you grab the bar at the top, you can pull that across to the left side. You can put it back to the right. If you try and drag it out of the screen, on the left hand side, it will not go. However, if you pull it over to the right hand side, it disappears off screen, it posts itself away. Now, if you just swipe back like that, the screen reappears. If you want to close the screen, you can just locate this bar at the bottom, swipe up and just swipe away. That closes the screen. So you also have the option of having more than one of these windows open at the same time. So let's grab Safari again, pop that there. And let's take the calendar, pop that there. And we'll also take notes. Right, so we have three open. So you may want to know which one you have, which ones you have open. Again, we go to this bottom bar and just swipe across and you can see what you have open. And when you swipe them off screen, they all go off screen and you can pull them all back. Um, if you want to visually see all of them at the same time, so you know exactly what you have open, grab this bar at the bottom and just push up. They will fan out and you can see each of the applications. You can close one from here if you so wish, just by swiping up. And if you want to just bring them back to their normal stack, so to speak, just press on one. If you'd like to use this app, um, as a split screen, as one half, what you can do is just grab this bar and just pull down and you can see the, the size changes and it goes kind of ready to fit into the screen. You can still swipe across and if you have any other sliding apps open, they will remain there. So that's how to use split screen and slide over apps for multitasking. Hopefully this has been useful to you. If it has, really appreciate it. If you can give me a thumbs up, it helps me out so much. Thanks very much for choosing my video and stay safe.